The 2019 hurricane season is now well underway, and so far, the season has been relatively tame. Only two names on this list have been used so far. Andrea was a preseason tropical storm in May, and Barry was briefly a full-fledged landfalling hurricane in Louisiana in July. Statistically, we are now headed into the meat of the season in late August, September, and October. And in fact, the season reaches a statistical peak on September 10th. There are a few factors that have led to this relatively slow start to the season. An El Nino pattern has led to unfavorable upper level winds, plus subsistence or sinking air caused drier than normal conditions over much of the main tropical development region. And then there is dust. A layer of Saharan dust from Africa to the Caribbean has been a contributing factor to stifle development so far. Recently, a few days ago, NOAA changed their mind on how they think the rest of the hurricane season will unfold. They have now declared El Nino over, and they think that should lead to an above average rest of the season, with perhaps five to nine hurricanes and two to four major hurricanes. So, time will tell if they're right. The tropics may come alive in a big way sooner rather than later. This is Blue Water Chief Meteorologist Rich Thomas for the Alabama News Network.